morning today i was going to do a quick review on the uh this new ball head i've got it's the pro media gear bh1 i think it's nicknamed the sputnik because of this weird design but i bought the uh pro media gear uh katana jr uh, gimbal head and i absolutely love that one i'll do a review on it in a little bit but um their quality is just amazing and uh, the detail and everything uh, is great. Uh, I've had my gimbal head for probably a year and a half now and no issues at all. I mean, it's been through a um, bear chewing on and knocking over my tripod. I mean, that's what happened to uh, when you let a bear get up too close to your tripod and knock it over. But uh, anyway, I was just going to test this new gadget out and see i mean so far playing with it uh, everything is just wonderful this thing can spin in any direction i mean it's uh as you can see here it's just very easy to operate it's one knob to uh, control and then you got a panning knob that lets you turn everything um but i love the big the big knob here uh, let me zoom out soon it's got a it's got a level underneath um you know plus it's got a level on the top side up here too for your camera but yeah i mean it's just things uh move so fluidly it's and like i said you can spin it turn it any any direction so that'll be good for uh, Milky Way shots about any any kind of predicament you can get in but I've, I've noticed that a lot of uh, doing night sky and stuff uh, most of your conventional ball heads uh, sometimes you have problems you know tilting uh, at certain angles and stuff so uh, this should eliminate that problem let me go get the camera and see what it looks like set up and here's what it looks like with the camera set up on it uh, this is the Nikon uh, D850, which is a, you know, it's a big body. Um, and you can see this is a pretty, pretty big, robust uh, ball head. Uh, it's, uh, it stands up pretty, pretty high off the uh, tripod. But this thing locks down solid. I mean, you're not, not getting any kind of movement at all out of it. Uh, so, yeah, it looks like it's going to hold up very well. It's really, really smooth. I mean, good fluid uh, action is smooth. No, no sticking, no catching. The other uh, ball head, my old one that I've had about two or three years now, it's a, uh, um, it's starting to stick a little bit, and it's got a couple places it catches when you're panning. Um, this one is really good. Uh, I mean, just really, really smooth. And it locks down real tight. I mean, it's got, you know, no slip um, notches in here where you're, when you tighten the camera down. Uh, and I think it's rated to hold uh, 55 pounds, which, you know, <laughs> you're not going to, that's a, uh, it's going to be hard to get 55 pounds worth of camera weight on there. I think it, this camera set up uh, maybe four pounds right now, five. Um, let me loosen Kind of hard to do and hold this. But yeah, you can see, I mean, any kind of, you can point straight down. Um, to do macro, uh, any kind of angle in the sky. So yeah, this is pretty, pretty sweet. And just a couple of turns and it's locked down tight. But yeah, so far, very happy, very happy with it. Uh, and you can go check out Pro Media Gear. Uh, everything that I bought from them has been state of the art, uh, made in the USA. Uh, 
very high quality and so i think i'm gonna be very happy with this thank y'all